I'm here at the 23rd International St. John's Film Festival. It's actually the St. John's International Women's Film Festival. And who else to launch this festival than Deepa Mehta, the internationally acclaimed Canadian director. Welcome to the festival. Thank you so much. It's an absolute pleasure to be here. Well, you, you have been showing your film at festivals around the world since TIFF about a month ago. Mm -hmm. And obviously you can attend every festival, but this one, you made, you made a point to come out here. What's the importance of this festival to you? Uh, I think uh, why I find this particular festival really appealing is twofold. One is it that it's at St. John's, and I've always wanted to come to St. John's. And the other is the festival itself, the fact that it's an international women's festival and has been a real pioneer of a women's festival you know, for many, many years. And I've been trying to make it work, and this time it just did. Well, it looks like it's just timing came into place. Kismet, maybe? Maybe Kismet, indeed. Now, your films always deal with a very, sometimes controversial subject matter, and this film is no exception, based on Salman Rushdie's acclaimed novel. Can you tell us a little bit about the road to get this film to screen? Was it as difficult as some of your previous movies? Uh, you know, I'm of the opinion that any film that you want to do, whether it's a short film or a long-form film, is difficult to do. Uh, in Whether you're a Canadian or whether you're from American or whether you're Indian, all films are tough to do. Uh, this was, I would say, uh, a logistically a difficult film to do because uh, it's a film that spans 60 years. It's a film that is, uh, has 19 main characters and it's a film that's about, you know, family, the importance of family, and uh, uh, romance, tragedy, big wars. Mm -hmm. So logistically, it was challenging. Well, I found what you said, that every film, short feature, is a difficult challenge to make. And I think many of our members would appreciate that comment because a lot of them are aspiring filmmakers. Mm -hmm. What would be the biggest piece of advice you'd have to give to somebody who's trying to make it in this industry? I think the most important thing, if you, if you want to be a filmmaker, is... Uh, you must have passion for what you do. If you think that it's going to be glamorous, it's, this, is not, <laughs> this is not for you because it's uh, a lot of hard work. Uh, but you, know, you have to feel really passionately about doing your project. So I, I remember uh, I felt, even for Midnight's Children, which is like my seventh feature film, I felt that if I didn't do it, I would die. Right. And, you know, it was, it's that kind of a thing that comes from the pit of your stomach. So. Without passion, forget it. With passion, you can conquer the world. A mentor once said to me, it's like having a pilot light that won't go out no matter how hard you try to squash it because of its that's, impracticality. Uh, that's a, good, a very good analogy. And what do you say to those filmmakers who are like, but everybody keeps saying no to me? Uh, it's about perseverance, like I said. You know, it's passion, perseverance, that's what it's about. The two big Ps. Words to live by. Thank you so much, Deepa, and good luck with the film. Thank you so much. Thank you.